We're seeing the results. The, the produce is actually looking better. It's bigger, healthier, glossier, and our sales have gone up. Um, the demand for our cherry tomatoes, as, as one of the examples, is just uh, unprecedented. We haven't had such high sales. People look at it and just, you know, they have to have it. Hi, my name is Darren Greenfield with Weimar Farm. We grow fruit like pluots and peaches and nectarines. We also have a lot of summer crops like melons, watermelon, cantaloupe. We have a lot of summer squash, all the different varieties. My primary purpose for this farm is to give young people, students, uh, exposure to agriculture done right, regenerative agriculture. Our fertility program that we've been working with over the last nine years has been uh, testing the soil. We get the balance of minerals back into the soil and we've seen good results come but we, we noticed that uh, the, the organic matter was going down on our reports every year and it just seemed like we weren't uh, nourishing the biology and, and getting that full system of life uh, generated and so when I learned about AEA and listened to the podcasts and see that they've got a whole package of nutrition and and things that nourish you know those forms of life um, so regenerative farming is is restoring life life back into the soil life back into the trees uh, regenerative farming is it has the goal of of basically getting the the plants and trees to the point where they have a resistance to disease resistance to the pest so the challenges that we have seen uh, reversed through using regenerative practices have been primarily the aphid uh, problem that we had. In fact, there wasn't hardly any green on the leaves. They, they were fairly yellow at the beginning of the season. The pluots had uh, aphids that were curling the leaves under. They were populating there. The leaves were not doing their, their work of photosynthesis. We weren't seeing growth. And as soon as we uh, put the nutritional package that was recommended as a result of the uh, uh, sap analysis. After that, we've never seen aphids come back. So when we measured what was being translocated, what we noticed was there's a lot of micronutrient deficiencies. So we actually went and did some um, nutrition applications, both through the soil and foliarly, uh, to correct those deficiencies. Once we corrected uh, those deficiencies showing up in the sap, then the trees really sprang back to life. Here we have an example compared with this old growth that with the curling of leaves we have this new growth. In fact you can see from here to here we've got a good three plus feet of, of new growth that these plants put on after they got the applications uh, that were prescribed. The leaves are not curled, um, they're healthy and green and it's just the whole tree is just broken out with new growth. So with regenerative farming that we've started to practice here, we are seeing things uh, improving. We actually have seen the fruit get bigger. We've seen stronger, healthier plants, more resistant to the uh, pest problems. And we're seeing the regeneration actually occurring here. And uh, so we feel like we're on the right track. And uh, as we stay on this program, uh, I know that next year we're going to see even better results. We've really only been doing it for one year and uh, the results are very clear and I'm convinced that um, AEA really has a, a, a wonderful package that is complete.